Okay, YouTube, today I am going to review the Noble Men's Lightweight T-shirt. I bought the shirt for $38 on the Noble website. Uh, placed the order on Sunday, got it on Saturday. Really quick response. Um, lots of fun to buy when the websites react that quickly. Um, here's the package. Came in this plain plastic bag. Uh, simple generic packaging, plain but nicely done. Uh, I, I typically like to see some customized packaging with logo on there and some printing. Um, kind of adds to the whole e-commerce experience. Nonetheless, at least needs to be functional, um, clean, and this one most certainly is. Uh, very, very neatly packed inside a perfectly fitting bag. Um, let's open it up, see what we got. Quick, nice little piece of tissue paper inside that's to prevent wrinkling. And uh, just your basic t-shirt, just a um, heat seal label in the neck, no other paper labels to itch or irritate you. Um, here we go. You see that real quick we'll do a close-up in a little bit here um, just to let's get a little of this information out of the way here okay so made in Vietnam not by us but exciting close at least they're in the right country uh, fiber content it's 50% model 45% cotton 5% spandex so model for those of you who watch my earlier videos you know model is a little bit more of a durable version of rayon part of that whole viscose family of fibers and uh, sometimes you can even see um, model reference just as viscose and um, that's perfectly fine. The company calls out the performance features as lightweight breathable model blend and so I think that's kind of self-explanatory. Um, the care instructions are all in symbolic form only so these are called the uh, international symbols for care instructions and there's five of them um, where there are five symbols that are we're supposed to put on the care label this particular garment has seven symbols so we're gonna have to see what the last two are for uh, I'm not really familiar with them uh, the, so the first one looks like a cup and I'll post a little picture over here on my shoulder so you can see what I'm looking at uh, it looks like a cup and it has a little single dot in the center. So that's your international symbol for washing and the single dot is the temperature, which means cold. So one dot cold, two dots warm, three dots hot. And uh, so this is gonna wash cold, um, most likely because they wanna protect the color. Uh, me, I wash everything on warm and uh, I'm sure this would be fine too. Second symbol looks like a triangle and uh, that stands for bleach and there's an X through it so they don't want you to bleach this garment. Um, a shaded in triangle means bleach and I think one that's like got like stripes on it uh, means non-chlorine bleach. So anyways this one they don't want you to use any bleach. Um, next symbol is a square with a circle in it and a dot. So that's your dryer temperature. Um, that square with the circle represents a dryer and single dot, so they want you to tumble dry cold. Um, once again, I don't see anything just by the, the, the blend that would warrant this to be cold and not uh, warm or, you know, I mean hot, you have to worry about shrinkage, but um, I don't see any reason why you just couldn't throw this in the dryer on a regular dryer cycle. Uh, with your other clothes. Next symbol is um, tough to describe but it looks like an iron and they have an X through it they don't want you to iron this is a, um, a t-shirt anyways and so don't iron your t-shirts just let them hang and they should uh, all the wrinkles should fall out and then lastly is the last symbol is just a circle and this is a symbol for dry cleaning and uh, this one has an X through it as well, so no dry cleaning. And um, once again, t-shirt, you shouldn't have to dry clean it anyways. You should wash it at home. It's so simple, right? Just throw it in the washer, in the dryer. You can even take it out while it's still a little moist out of the dryer, put it on a hanger, and all the wrinkles are going to drop out. That spandex in there is going to help, and uh, you're going to have a 
you know, a nice looking shirt to wear when ready to wear when you are. Um, the sixth symbol here kind of looks like a flower. Now, uh, I don't think that is an internationally recognized or required symbol. Um, correct me if anybody's familiar with these, you can put them in the comments below. Um, but that I'm pretty sure is for softener. It has an X through it. They don't want you to use softener. Any type of active wear, and I've discussed this a number of times in my videos, active wear, you don't want to use softener. Softener will make it hydrophobic, meaning repel moisture, and that'll make it hotter, not as breathable. And of course, you want that moisture wicking and the quick dry for cooling uh, for any type of apparel that's associated with active wear. Um, this is an all-day wear t-shirt. It's not specifically for active wear, but you could wear it to exercise. Um, and so I guess kind of want it to always be breathable and cool, dry, and comfortable. That last symbol, I don't know what it is. If I had to guess, uh, it has an X through it. It's going to be something to mean to wash with light colors. Um, I can't even make out. It's too small and not clear for me. Um, once again, if any of you recognize what that is, um, or you work for Noble and you know what it is, please comment below, let me know. Um, but that would be my guess is that to wash with light colors because that's really the only instruction that's missing um, on it. So anyways, let's try this shirt on. Let's see how it fits and um, stick around. It should be a good video. All right, guys, so this is what uh, the shirt looks like on. And uh, let me know what you think. I think it's a perfect fit. Um, really excited about it and uh, it's not too tight it's hitting me in the right spot everywhere but not pulling I feel like I could wear this shirt all day long work out in it go shopping in it um, it's really soft and comfortable so I think uh, if anybody would want to purchase the shirt based on what I'm reviewing um, you can't go wrong um, if you like my video please give me a thumbs up below there subscribe to my channel if you want to learn about Aurora and more of our products and what we have, um, just give me a call, put a comment below, or send me an email. I'll be happy to make arrangements to show you our collection. Either we could do it over a Zoom call or Teams or what have you, or uh, in-person visits. I travel all over the country and uh, carry a whole collection of different items that we produce. And uh, you all stick. Please uh, come see me in future videos and continue to dress smart. Take care.